my name is Bobby and I am Wacky and welcome, welcome, welcome to Wacky Back Wednesday. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. It is Wednesday. Yeah. This Wednesday, we will be taking a look at my top five. You're just kidding. Do you really think I would tell you so soon? Um, no, but it's Wednesday, and you know what that means. It's a Wednesday where I take random comment suggestions by you guys, lovely peoples of the world, and I answer them to the best of my ability. This week is one that has been suggested several times, and that was suggested by Sweet Dreams Tweens, I believe. Let me uh, check up on that. Yes, Sweet Dreams Tweens. So thank you, Sweet Dreams Tweens. And it is top five favorite hobbies. That's right, top five favorite hobbies. Yay. So um, you get to see what I do in my free time. Alright, so without further ado, let's get into it. So, number one, and I'm starting out with the more obvious choice, and that is video games. Playing video games, recording video games, YouTube, that all goes in with video games. Um, I love video games. They're the best. Like... So good. I don't know, but I really love playing video games. Video games is one of my favorite hobbies. Moving on to number two. And number two is... Card collecting. Now, um, this goes for baseball cards, basketball cards, any type of sport cards. Um... I used to love, as you can tell here. Um, and uh, this was like 2010, actually, so it wasn't too long ago. But I have ones, my dad collected cards. I, I stopped, though. But this is... What's this? This was from... 2006? Brandon Wright from the Warriors. Um, as I said, baseball, basketball, football cards. I had them all. I still do have them all, but I stopped. I just I stopped collecting them a little while back. Um, 2010, I think, was like the last year that I collected them, as you can see. But yeah, these aren't all the cards that I have. My <laughs> my desk is filled with them. And yeah, so that was number that was number two. Moving on to number three. Um. <laughs> I cracked myself up. Can you tell, Bobby? You're so stupid, man. <laughs> Alright, so number three is toy collecting, basically, like, um, Skylanders. That's actually the main reason that I like Skylanders, is not because of the game, because of the toys. Like, I don't know, man, but, like, I just, I love to collect, like, figures and stuff like that. And I think, um, you know, I'm not the kind of guy that you'll go in to, um, my room or my house and just see shelves of action figures. It's mainly just Skylanders, but it's still, that's, I hardly ever find myself playing the actual game. Because, in my opinion, the game and even the toys are a little bit under my age. Um, I'm sorry, but, like, it's... 
I do it because I like collect. I'm, I'm a collector, and that's basically the only reason I do things. It's not just Skylanders. I mean, it's mainly Skylanders. Like as I said, you're not gonna walk in my room and see action figures all over the place. But you know, I got like Minecraft dudes. I got baseball players. Um. Just, you know, like, Mario. That's really it. Other than Skylanders, I don't do, like, Disney Infinity and stuff. Lego. I like Lego. Um, I count those as action figures. So, yeah, man. And then, uh, also, like, back in, um, like, 2006 and 7, and 2007 and stuff, when the movie first came out, um, Cars, it was, like, my favorite movie of all time. And I, uh... Dude, I collected those little Mattel cars like there was no tomorrow. <laughs> like, seriously, it was so funny. It was so funny. Um, but uh, yeah, I collected them like there was no tomorrow, and uh, which, which leads me into my fourth favorite hobby, which is cars, um, just like race cars, vroom vroom, in, um, in general, um, but, uh, yeah, so, I just, I love cars, man, like Ferraris and Lamborghinis and all that junk, they're the best. If only I could afford one. <laughs> um, but, uh, no, yeah, I love cars. Um, they're so cool. I don't know. I don't know, man. No. Number five, though. Number five. I was, I was a little bit torn. Because I like Rubik's Cubes, and I, I feel like... I don't know. Don't know. Like, I mean, I really like Rubik's Cubes, and I would consider them a hobby. Um, like, but, I have so many other hobbies that, uh, I just, I don't know. Um, but yeah, I wouldn't consider Rubik's Cubing like, cubing a hobby, I don't know if you would, but, I don't know, I really like Rubik's Cubes, and, uh, I also really like magic, like magic tricks, but, I love sports, like baseball, and I mean I like basketball, but baseball, man, like you can see, I'm wearing baseball camp, um, t-shirt right now, and you can, you can see all of the, these are all game balls and stuff, that that's a funny story. That game ball right there. This will make for a really good story time. First game I ever played, I got the game ball. It was opening day of my first Little League game. And I got the game ball. This, my first double. No, that's my first double back there. The lamp's kind of blocking it. This is my first home run. No, that's my first home run. This one. Six strikeouts. Two. Alright. Three innings pitched. Six strikeouts. No runs. No earned runs. Stole home to win the game. And broke a bunch of stuff with another ball. Anyways, yeah, so as you can tell, I'm a really big baseball fanatic. Uh huh. So baseball's gonna, I'm gonna have to go with baseball, and then number six is definitely magic. Um, and 
Rubik's cubes too. You know, like I like Rubik's cubes, and they're good. But that does it for this wacky fact Wednesday. Um, as I solve the cube. <laughs> um, but yeah, man. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have, rating would be super duper very much appreciated. Other than that, though. Comment what you think next week's Wacky like, Fact Wednesday should be about, because there were a lot of good suggestions. Anyways, till next time. Actually, I will be streaming later today in about half hour or so. Maybe later. Um, and that'll be, um, that'll be like 2.30 Pacific and then five five thirty Eastern time and then um, uh, about ten thirty uh, or not ten thirty I'm sorry um like one thirty Pacific or uh, UK time something like that. If you're watching in UK and it's like 1.30 in the morning, I don't suggest that you should get some rest for school tomorrow if you have school. Anyways, I will stream tonight. I will not stream tomorrow, sadly. But I will stream Friday at about... Uh, God, I don't know. Probably like 7 Pacific, 10 Eastern time. And that'll go to about 12... Eastern, and like, you know, 9 Pacific, somewhere around there. Yeah, man, but anyways, hopefully you've enjoyed it, and I will see you next time.